in the journey to financial freedom and success, it's crucial to explore different ways of earning money. Depending only on one job might offer stability, but it often isn't enough to build wealth and reach millionaire status. That's where the idea of having multiple sources of income becomes important. As the saying suggests, most millionaires have about seven income streams. Welcome back to the Finance Homefront. I'm Bev. In this video, we'll look into these income streams and see how they can help you on your path to becoming a millionaire. Let's get started. Earned income stands as the most common form of income received through employment. It represents the compensation you receive from the time and effort invested in your job, often taking the form of an hourly wage, annual salary, or commission-based pay. The advantage of earned income lies in its consistency, offering a dependable source to cover living expenses and save for the future. It serves as a starting point for most individuals before diversifying into other income streams. However, limitations exist, dictated by employers, industries, and time constraints. And relying solely on earned income poses risks, especially during job loss. To maximize earned income, emphasis should be on skill development, networking, and pursuing career opportunities such as education, certifications, promotions, or transitioning to higher paying roles. Overall, earned income is the foundational step for building wealth. Capital gains. Capital gains represent profits derived from selling assets like stocks, real estate, or artwork at a higher price than the initial purchase cost. This income form is often linked with long-term investing, providing an effective means of wealth accumulation. The amount of capital gains is influenced by the asset's value at the time of sale and the initial purchase price. Holding an asset for over a year before selling may result in lower taxes compared to ordinary income. This strategy can lead to tax-free capital gain income for retirees using standard deductions. Capital gains offer a relatively effortless source of income once set up, although they can swiftly turn into losses, especially for inexperienced investors during market downturns. To maximize capital gain income, continual investment in a diversified portfolio of stocks, bonds, and income-producing assets with a focus on long-term holding is recommended. Interest income Interest income, a form of passive income, arises from lending money to others through savings accounts, money market accounts, or fixed income securities. This income stream offers reliability and predictability with fixed interest rates earned over a specified period. Considered a low-risk investment, interest income provides a guaranteed rate of return, making it appealing for those seeking a steady income without the volatility of other investments. Maximizing interest income involves exploring high-yield savings accounts, CDs, or investing in government or corporate bonds that offer competitive interest rates. However, it's essential to acknowledge the inflation risk associated with interest income. Fixed interest payments may lose purchasing power over time if inflation rates surpass the interest rates, even if the income is reinvested. Liking what you see so far? Do me a quick favor. Hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and don't forget to ring the notification bell. Your support means the world to us and helps our channel grow. Every click is a step closer to your financial goals and ours. Okay, back to the ball game. Dividend income. Dividend income is a type of money you get without actively working for it. It comes from owning stocks that pay dividends, which are a share of a company's profits given to its shareholders. Unlike the ups and downs of the stock market, dividend income is often seen as steadier and can provide a regular flow of money over time. In tough times like the Great Depression, when stock prices fell a lot, dividend income didn't drop as much. It's like a safety net when stock prices take a hit. Still, it's not a sure thing because companies can decide to lower or stop giving dividends. But generally, it tends to stick around. One cool thing about dividend income is that it might keep up with prices going up. Companies sometimes increase their dividends to match higher prices. To get more dividend income, you can invest in good stocks known for regular dividends or use funds that focus on such stocks. Rental income. Rental income is another way to earn money without actively working every day. 
It comes from owning and renting out places like houses or apartments. This kind of income is nice because it happens regularly, usually every month, and can help pay off things like the mortgage or other property costs. The good thing about rental income is that it can keep up with the rising cost of living, acting like a shield against inflation. Plus, there's a tax benefit. You can subtract rental expenses like mortgage interest and property taxes from your rental income. To make the most of your rental income, it's smart to pick a property in a popular area or one with special features. You can also hire someone to manage the property and make sure you get the most income. But remember, rental income comes with challenges. Sometimes you might not have tenants, or finding reliable ones can be tricky. Owning a rental property needs time, effort, and money, so it might not be the best fit for everyone. Business income Business income is the money you make from running your own business. It's a type of earned income that can bring in a lot of money and help you build wealth over time. Having your own business gives you the freedom to set your own schedule and make decisions that directly impact how you earn. Another perk is the tax benefits. You can subtract certain expenses from your income, which lowers the amount of taxes you have to pay. To make the most of your business income, it's a good idea to invest in a business with a high potential for growth and profit. Online businesses are a great start because they usually cost less and can reach more customers using technology and social media. But remember, owning a business has its challenges like competition and costs, and it takes time and effort. Royalty Income Royalty income is money you get without doing much, earned by owning and licensing things like patents, copyrights, or trademarks. This type of income brings in a steady flow of money regularly, based on how much your intellectual property is used or sold. One of the cool things about royalty income is that it keeps coming without needing a lot of maintenance or ongoing investment. Owning intellectual property like songs or books also gives you a level of protection. Others can't use or profit from your creative works. To get more royalty income, it's smart to invest in intellectual property that many people want, like a popular song or book. You can also team up with a licensing agency or publisher to handle the licensing and distribution for you. But keep in mind, royalty income comes with the risks. The demand for your intellectual property can change, and getting and maintaining it takes time and money, which might not always pay off. Remember, Building a strong foundation is the first step. Once you've established a solid base, you can strategically diversify when the time is right. It's not a race to accumulate every income stream. It's about making choices that align with your lifestyle and personality. Just remember that this here is not financial advice. We highly recommend to do your own research and speak to a professional. Our financial journeys are different, so make sure your decision aligns with your situation. Now, here's a thought to ponder. What income streams resonate with you? Are you aiming for several smaller ones or are you focused on cultivating one substantial source? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you found this video valuable, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe to our channel, and ring that notification bell to stay updated on more insightful content. Until next time.